That's why Nigeria's first lady, Senator Luremi Tinubu, has introduced programs through the Renewed Hope Initiative that complement the efforts of President Bola Tinubu's administration in making lives better for the poor and vulnerable. The first lady announced the launch of a program that will ensure more girls are enrolled in schools across the country, as well as another initiative that will encourage youths to get involved in agriculture. State House correspondent Femi Akonde reports. The first physical meeting between the First Lady Senator Ulure Mitunubu and the wives of the 36 state governors. This year, the Renewed Hope Initiative of the First Lady is expanding its outreach through the rollout of new programs in agriculture, education, and economic empowerment. These interventions are intended to help beneficiaries get by at the impact of the removal of fuel subsidy bites hard. I equally commend you all for your various efforts in your individual states. I charge you all not to relent as our actions will contribute to the overall development and prosperity of our nation. Times like this calls for sober reflection. The wives of governors across the 36 states and the mandate secretary for women and affairs in the FCT are saddled with the responsibility of monitoring the implementation of these programs. The First Lady also announced the reintroduction of the Alternative High School for Girls, an initiative launched in 2007 when she was First Lady of Lagos State. This will ensure the girl child is not left behind and also accelerate the achievement of Sustainable Development Goal 4 and 5. Osho State was picked as the first to pilot the alternative high school for girls program. Talk about the girl child, the girl child. Being an educationist, I believe that a girl should be given a second chance. Even if we trip, we all want second chance. No matter what happens to us, man is not perfect. So we, we trip, but we should pick up and do better. The same way you know better, you do better. The Ministry of uh, Education has superb. They work hand in hand to monitor the building of the schools and um, I think I'll discuss with him that we should do it on the three senatoria. And I was thinking that is it red or black on the back? The highlight of the meeting was the unveiling of the proposed Young Farmers Club for public schools in each state of the federation with the proposed uniforms for members. Senator Olure Mitinubu says this program is tagged food on every table and will encourage food production among the youth. Femi Akon, TVC News, Abuja.